Hello Guardians, welcome back to a brand new video for you guys. Today we're going to be talking about the Pacific Loot Strikes. My Pacific Loot was the Echo Chamber, the mine of all mines. This one was technically one of my best, best strike missions that I ever played in Destiny because this shit was challenging. And plus when they had it like reborn or some shit or taken somehow, the shit was just even more intense than it was before. I mean, how it was was just unbelievable. But besides all that, there was a specific, specific item that I wanted for my Warlock. But I was playing as my Titan during my mistake. But in the end, I got the gauntlet that all Warlocks that I see throughout Destiny has been wearing. And this one has been by far one of my favorite gauntlets for my Warlock. I don't know why, but it's one of my favorites. And once you see it on here, yes, this gauntlet that I'm talking about for my Warlock, this Warlock gauntlet was one of my favorites and I had to have it as my Pacific Loot. Now, all the rest of Pacific Loots, I was doing, you know, really well. But for some reason, my Titan always the one that gets that Pacific ones. Now, when I play with my Hunter or I play with, like, my Warlock in general, they don't necessarily get the things that they want. They necessarily get the opposite things, like they get a freaking weapon or something in that nature. But every time I play with my titan he guarantees me a, a unbelievable standpoint let's just put it in that nature now the other way to get this loot you have to have a skeleton key now that's the only way you get pacific loots now a lot of people say can i use three of coins i don't know what's going on with the three of coins it hasn't been really working out here late it has been causing a lot of problems throughout destiny i don't know if they're just getting rid of three of coins here or late but a lot of people said they preferred using quest lines to get the exotic weapons that they want of their choice now that is a very easy standpoint like i got the gallon horn it was very challenging let me just tell you the quest lines of getting exotics are very very challenging steps but a lot of people see this as a little bit easier more comp set than anything but this gauntlet right here you had to play the echo chamber to get the specific gauntlet now there has been other times i play echo chambers i got other things besides the you know the warlock gauntlet i had weapons i had necessary things and all that stuff so it depends on what character you play you get those necessary items now i play with my titan and i got that gauntlet for my warlock which is pretty amazing i play as my titan to see what he will get when he's playing the echo chamber but nothing didn't happen, but it happened anyways. It happened for my Warlock, but nothing didn't happen for my Titan. Yes, he got another Skeleton Key in the process. I think this is the one that I got the Skeleton Key, if I'm not mistaken. Yes, he got a Skeleton Key in the process. But I was very happy when I got this. Now, I didn't play... I didn't... I did kill the, the, the enemy first and see what happens when I use the three of coins, but nothing didn't really happen. I just got rare items with high light levels. That's what usually the case. But skip all that. With this specific gauntlet, this has some really interesting things that will really help you out in the process. Now, as you can see in front of your screen, this, this thing right here, whoever designed this did the best thing. It will increase your intelligence, which is really nice if you want that. Increase your discipline. Uh, impact inductions but another thing that was really surprised me was the energy projection meaning it would increase your chances of throwing a grenade with long distance so that would definitely help me out in the crucible because i'm always throwing grenades to kill enemies and another thing is also auto auto rifle loader means it will increase the reload speed reload speed of your idle rifles that would definitely help me out through the process let me know in this comment section down below do you think this was the best gauntlet for your warlock or what was another gauntlet that you guys really enjoy remember if you're new to this channel make sure you hit that sub box and make sure when you hit the sub box you hit that notification bell if you did like this video hit that like button if you didn't hit that dislike button and i would definitely see you guys in my next destiny post